able to flow and walk like this. This song is really fun, so I put together a really beginner friendly routine for you guys to learn. A few disclaimers before we get started. The first disclaimer is that this tutorial is going to be mirrored. In my last tutorial, I asked whether you prefer it to be mirrored or not, and quite a few of you said yes. So I am going to mirror it. Please let me know in the comments below what you do prefer. Second disclaimer, I am going to go through all of the moves quite quickly, but at the end, I will go through them all together. You can keep rewinding as many times as you need to until you've got all of the moves down. And last disclaimer is that the song won't be in this tutorial video, and that's purely because of copyright. The song is in the dance video, which I will leave links down below in the description, as well as the pinned comment. So you can click through and practice with the music as many times as you like as soon as you finish learning this routine. But without further ado, let's get started learning this routine. So we're going to start with two walks forward. Bear in mind this song is called a walk like this, so you really want your walks to be super confident. So we're going to start on this left leg and we're just going to hit a left, right. And I'm going to make these walks small now because I'm filming this for you guys, but when you actually do them, make them as big as you want. And you want to use your arms because you want them to be like really confident walks. So we're just left, left, right. Out. As we step out, we're placing that left hand on our hip and we're going to catch by scooping this right leg up twice. The footwork is just going to be out, in, and out, in. So it's kind of like you're tapping the foot on the floor and then scooping it up, scooping it up. And you really want to use your hips there when you do this. And then we're going to use our right arm as well. We're just going to place it out to the side and we're just going to scoop, scoop. And you can also add your head here as well. So there's a lot of different components, but you just really want to make this look super, super confident. Okay, boom, 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 boom. From here, we're placing that right leg down and we're going to push this right arm around like so. So, all it's doing is going around to the front, and as we do that, we're placing the weight on our right leg. We're using our hips to circle around like so. So, boom. From here, we're going to bring the left leg in to join the right leg. We're going to place the hands on our knees. We're just going to push forward. And then our head is going to come up. It's always like we're snaking through it and then your head is the last thing to come up. So we finish here. We're going to push, bring the left leg in, push through, and the head comes up. From here, we're going to hit boom, boom. So all we're doing is we're tapping that right leg twice. That is all our feet are doing. With our eyes, you can bring the left arm up to your head or whatever you feel is the most comfortable. You can also leave that with your knee. There's a lot of freedom with that choice. Your right arm is just going to push over and over as that right leg taps twice. So we just say over, over. From here, we're going to step this right leg across and we're just going to hit bum. So as we do it, just bring that right arm up like so. And then we're stepping that left leg out so our feet are in this strong second position. So that's just going to look like tap, tap, push, and from here we're going to bend both of our legs and we're going to push our arms down and in between our legs like so. And you're really kind of dropping your weight. So we're here and we're then going to twist this right leg in and then we're going to twist the left leg in like so. So all we're doing here is we're just twisting, right leg twisting, left leg and your arms are down like so. And all that move is going to do is make your hips pop like so. So that looks really, really effective. So we've got right, left. From here, we're going to straighten our legs and we're going to bring our arms up and over our chest like so. And we're always doing a bit of a body ripple through here. So boom, and then we're going to hit down. So we're putting our weight all the way down to the floor, but this is really, really quick. So we're going boom, down, and then we're going to catch this as we come up. And we're just going to cross our arms like so. To continue, all we're going to do here is we're going to hit a hip to the right, hip to the left, hip to the right. From here, we're going to step on this left leg, and that's just going to be the preparatory step. So we're going to step, we're going to drop our arms, and we're just going to catch this. We're going to step this right leg across, and we're going to hit bum, bum, bum. That's the foot back. So all we're doing is stepping that right leg across, kind of putting the weight onto it, going back onto the left, and then going back onto the right. Your arms here are like really free. I'm just going to hit bum, bum, bum. And this is as they say, walk like this. You kind of want to be like, walk like this, basically. From here, they're going to say something about like your hips working side to side. So all we're going to do is we're going to step this left leg out. We're just going to hit hip to the left, and then hip 
to the right. And as we do that, we just drop to our arms behind us like so. And these two hips are quite slow, so you have time to really fill them through. We're then going to catch three quicker hips, so we're going to have bum, bum, bum. And these are a little bit more playful, so you can kind of bring your arms up. Your arms can like be completely free here, whatever you feel the most comfortable doing. So we're going to have two slow hips, and then hip, hip, hip. From here, we're going to step forward on this right leg. We're just going to step and bring that left leg up like so. So it's kind of just bending up behind us. And then we're going to step back. Our arms here are going to push out like so. They're kind of like out. You can either keep them in a fist or put them in a flat. We're going to have a little shoulder shrug as that left leg comes up. And then drop it as we step back like so. We're then going to step out with this right leg. And we're just going to push. Our weight is kind of going around, so our right leg is on our tiptoe. We're just pushing that right leg out and then bending it in like so. We're then going to bring the left leg into join as we hit hip and hip. This would be a lot easier if you could like grab one to your tracksuit muscles, but obviously I'm not wearing them right now. But you just want to kind of like hit a hip and hip with the shoulders, so your shoulders are just going push on push. And from here to finish off this routine, we're just going to step forward on this right leg. We're going to bring our arms over our head like so. So we're going to hit them as we step that right leg forward. And then we're going to push round. So our arm is almost like guiding our leg. So we're going to push, push. And then we're going to step to the back to catch our um, hip. So we're just doing two steps to the back and ending in whatever pose you want to end in. But that is the end of the routine. That is all of the videos broken down for you guys. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go back to the beginning of the routine and I'm going to go through the whole routine a little bit faster, but not completely up to speed. And when you guys have managed to master that, you can click on the link to watch the dance video and practice with the music as many times as you need to. So from the beginning, we're going to hit five, six, seven, eight. Walk, two, catch, and catch, and push. Down, head, over, over, hip, and drop, and hip, and hip, over, down, up, one, two, three. Step, and cut, and cut, hip, hip, one, and two. Step, and step, push, up, shoulder, shoulder, round, hip, and hip. But that's the end of this tutorial. I really hope you guys have managed to learn this routine. If you do learn it and you film yourself, I would love to watch my socials are always linked down below. If you did enjoy this video, please don't forget to hit that thumbs up button and subscribe if you are new around here. I post dance videos and tutorials all the time, as well as weekly vlogs every single week. You can also turn on my post notification bell so that way you won't miss whenever I post a new video. But apart from that, don't wait to see you too long. I hope you guys are having a great day and I will see you in my next video.